Hello, I'm James. And I'm Una, and you may be wondering why we have these long, hard things in our mouths. It's because we are the ringmasters of a brand new show featuring everything that's queer in culture across Australia. It's called The Strip. On Inside Out. On Unseen TV. On the internet. In your home. And on your computer. So now you know exactly where to find us. Coming up, we've got an interview with Michael Rolick, the CEO of New Mardi Gras. And see how we got on at my queer career, the opening night of Mardi Gras Film Festival. But first, the news. Brazil, gay-friendly country or not? If you're like a lot of us, you'd say definitely gay-friendly country. Well, over the past 20 years, almost 3,000 gays and lesbians have been murdered in Brazil for no other reason than being homosexual. This has all culminated this week in a 27-year-old gay man's asylum seeker application being approved in the United States. He'll now live in New Jersey. Over in Italy, a new transgender prison has opened. It is the world's first. There are about 60 trannies living in Italy's prisons for crimes such as sex work and drug use. This new 35-room centre will include a soccer court where the trannies can now live comfortably without fear of being harassed by the wider general population. Hi, I'm Kobe and I'm here at the opening of the Mardi Gras Film Festival, My Queer Career. The night is held at City Recital Hall, Angel Place. There were eight queer films across Australia that competed for the top prize. The My Queer Career winner was The Sun by Nathan King. The night flooded but we sure went out with a bang. The film festival has three weeks to go, so ensure you get in to see another film. Fantastic stuff going on this month. Fair Day, that's on Sunday the 21st of February at Victoria Park in Sydney. Come down and see us and thousands of other queer people. We'll all be having a fantastic time. Queer Thinking, this is like the Festival of Dangerous Ideas, but for queer people. It starts at midday on the 26th of February, that's a Friday. And the other unmissable thing which I cannot wait to get involved in is to get your pubic out in public. That's right, artist Spencer Tunic is doing one of his incredible installations using naked human people and architecture. This time on the steps of the Sydney Opera House, kicking off early morning. For all the information on this, you need to check the website www.mardigras.org.au. Hi, I'm here with the CEO of New Mardi Gras, Michael Rollick. Are you there? Thanks, Una. So, Michael, you volunteered with Mardi Gras for years before you became CEO. Can you tell us a little bit about your journey? My journey actually started off on the parade. Um, my first parade was back in 1992, and um, it was my coming out parade, if you like. Um, two friends of mine um, that had been out for a while said, come on, you've got to come along, you're going to... This is going to blow your mind away. The next year I became a parade volunteer and sort of haven't looked back and for many, many years um, volunteered on the parade up to a position of like entrant director, I was on the board as parade director and then I sort of went overseas for a couple of years for work and then this role came up and I applied for it and here I am. <laughs> so Michael, how do you feel that New Mardi Gras creates a real impact on the world stage, not just locally for our community? I think in the mainstream now, people see us as a, legi a legitimate part of Sydney, something that you know is Sydney. If you, if you took Mardi Gras away, Sydney wouldn't feel the same. And it is actually one of the few cultural events in this country on an annual calendar um, that is known not only here, but around the world. That's it from our first episode of The Strip. Thank you for being with us. You can email us your compliments or concerns to inside out at unseentv.tv or visit the website which is unseentv.tv and click on the inside out logo or if you come to fair day next week 21st of february you can meet us beat us no they need to meet us and greet us before they eat us and we get gotcha. to meet you so come visit our dedicated stand and say hi see you there <laughs>